Hey guys, this is Balu from Balu Prime and once again welcome you all back for an exciting tutorial. In this tutorial, let's see how we can create this basic glowing 3D title animation in Adobe After Effects using Element 3D plugin and how to place video onto the text in this tutorial. So I hope you will find this video useful but before going to that if you end up liking this video please click on the like button do share this content and if you are new to this channel consider subscribing my channel and support me. So further without any ado let's begin. So here we are in after effects now let's start this by creating a new composition. Further click on this new composition go to this preset options I am selecting HD 1080 which is a full HD resolution with a frame rate of 24 and duration of 10 seconds hit ok. Now let's input our text here, further click on this text icon and input your text, nice. So in order to increase the scaling of your text, select your text layer, press S on the keyboard and increase the scaling of the text. Nice. So, so now let's create a new solid layer for element 3D, further go to this layer options, new solid, let me rename this to element and hit ok. Now come to this effects and presets panel, if you are not finding this panel here, come to this window and enable effects and presets and look for element select this element and drop it onto this element layer now come to this custom layer options expand it expand this custom text and mask and in path layer one select your text layer now click on this scene setup so we got a new window to work in element 3d so now if we click on this extrude button we got our text here let me expand this we got one bevel so let's increase this extrusion value like 5 ok and let's select this extrusion model and let's rotate it in x axis 90 degree ok fine so now let's add a ground plane so click on this create button add a plane increase the scaling to 25 and 25 so let's move it down a bit this would be fine now select this extrusion model right click duplicate it now select bevel 1 in the duplicated model come to this extrusion options increase that extrusion to 6 and scroll down to this bevel outline properties and enable it so we got this nice bevel extrude here outwards so let me increase this bevel size to 1 fine so now let's add some materials here so select this ground plane plane model presets here i will be using this pro shaders too come to this metal and let me add this black metal fine select this uv and let me increase this to 5 and 5 now scroll down to this reflect mode and change it to mirror surface so we got this nice reflection also so now let's select this extrusion model so for this we are going to add video onto that so we are not going to add any material for this second select this one second one so come to this physical and add this bright light to this bevel one scroll down and let's change this color to bright orange fine so once it is done you can change the environment here which changes the look of the scene so for that click on this environment button and here i got some environment maps you can download free environment maps from google just search as environment maps you will get different maps here so i will be selecting this map here and open so suddenly you can see the difference in loop wise okay so i will be leaving it here and hit ok so we can hide out our text layer now so in order to view this in 3d space we need to create camera layer so for the go to this layer options new select camera let the default settings as it is and hit ok so now select this unified camera tool and let me rotate it here fine so now let's add some text onto this middle portion of our text so first we need to drag video onto this project panel so here i got a footage or video of fishes which i have downloaded from pixels download link in the description so drop it onto this timeline we can hide out it select this element layer 
effects control now scroll down to this custom texture maps in custom layers only expand it and in layer one select that video layer okay now again click on the scene setup now select that bevel where you want to add video scroll down where is this yeah come to this texture options diffuse click on this none set in drop down select that video so as soon as we do that you can see we got video here so it's okay so if you play this we can see video will be playing inside our text fine so now scroll down to this render settings ambient occlusion enable ambient occlusion and let me change this intensity to 10 find samples 32 and now let's add glow come to this glow expand it and enable glow let me reduce this glow intensity to 0.5 okay this is better so now let's add some camera animation here so select this camera layer first let me change this to track the camera tool hold left mouse key and drag upward to zoom in now let me select this unified camera tool so now expand this camera layer expand this transform options of camera layer be on the first frame enable keyframes of this point of interest and position fine now move five seconds forward in timeline select this track xy camera tool and drag the text here like this nice so now come to this edit options split layer now select this camera to layer expand it reset it fine come to this transform disable keyframes now let's position it rotate it here like this and drag the camera so here i will be doing a simple animation so enable keyframes once again move to this eighth second and zoom out fine so now if we play this animation you can say we got this simple animation going on fine So if you want to add depth of field, you can do that. So let me show you that also. So select this first camera layer, come to this camera options. So depth of field, just enable it here. Click on that off. It will be enabled. So let me increase this aperture to show you. Now we need to find out this focal length. Just try out different numbers here. Okay, I think this would be better. So I will be leaving this aperture to 267 only fine so if you want to add depth of field for this layer also same come to this camera options click on this depth of field so in this way we can create this simple or basic title animation in adobe after effects using element 3d plugin so I hope you guys have learned something new from this tutorial. If you have learned anything new, please like, share and subscribe my channel to support me. So we will meet in the next video. Until then signing off. Take care. Bye.